guys, it's Helena. Welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. I can't believe that we're already a full week into Vlogmas. More than a week into Vlogmas. A week and a day into Vlogmas. This is crazy. I'm so stunned, but like, time is going by so fast, but it's also like good because Christmas is coming up. Today's video is my winter night routine, and I'm probably going to do a winter morning routine slightly after this, so I will let you guys know when I post that video. It's currently 4.50 p.m., and I haven't really done much in a little bit. I've kind of just been, like, going around, because normally on Fridays, I go out to Buffalo for figure skating, but we didn't have ice, so I had to do ice in my home rink, and I did a, like, one to two session. And then after that, I went with my mom and we had to go get smoothie bowls. And then we had to make a few stops after that. So realistically, I only got home like 20, 30 minutes ago. So I'm just going to be walking through my night with you guys. I feel like normally my mornings are always pretty much very similar. But my nights can really vary depending on like what night of the week it is. And it's Friday. So it's a little bit different. And especially because I didn't have late skating I have a lot more time but realistically normally when I'm done with skating I don't get out until like 5 30. But I want to go ahead and jump right into today's video because I actually have a lot that I need to get done tonight. I'm going to kind of like plot out what I have to do for you guys and then we're going to do it all. So since it is Friday tomorrow is the 9th and I actually recently just got a job so I have orientation tomorrow around 2 45 or 2 30. 2.30 to 4.30 at the grocery store that I'm going to work at. But because I have dance all day tomorrow and I have to volunteer at the Rescue Horse Barn in the morning, then I have to like plan all of my stuff out now. I already took a shower this morning, so my hair is clean, but I'm going to straighten it tonight. I have to pick out my outfit for orientation, pack all my makeup, make sure that I have all my stuff for dance and the barn because I'm going to get out of rehearsal early so that I have time to get ready at the studio that my dad is going to take me from the studio to orientation. I also have to do a little bit of skincare. I have homework. I don't wanna do it, but I have homework. I have bio homework and government homework, but I have to do that. Also, I'm planning on making dinner with my dad tonight, so we're gonna make a pizza together, and I still have a lot of laundry that I have to do and put away. So that is pretty much our night plan grid whatever you want to call it, basically the plan for what I have to do tonight. Rough draft of it though. I'm going to start with my homework so that that can be like my set first thing that I know I have to get done. After that, I think I will pick out my outfit for orientation and then do my laundry, then straighten my hair. Then it'll probably be more, more like dinner time. Also, it's Friday, so I have to watch the Stoniola Triplets car video that comes out at 5.30. So I might have to take a break from my homework so I can get that done. Guys, that literally took forever. It's 6.04 now. But we still gotta stay productive and motivated in what we're doing because I still have so much to get done. And then I have to like fully edit this video. But I'm going to go ahead and bring all these books downstairs now and put them back on my desk. I'm also going to change over my laundry while I'm down there. And then I think I might come back upstairs and pick out what I'm going to wear for orientation. And also hopefully make dinner soon because I'm getting pretty hungry. So I just have this half load of laundry to put away, but I did finally decide what I'm going to wear for orientation, which is basically the same outfit that I wore in my Thanksgiving vlog, which looks like this. Super cute, super fun, just something like simple and easy. My dad told me that I should make the pizza, but low key, I really don't want to. So I might have him make it. Also, I don't know how to like spread out the dough. I don't know. I know how to cook some things, just not a full pizza. I'm also trying to decide when I want to straighten my hair because it's already 6.11, but at the same time, I feel like I don't want to do it now and I want to wait until like 8 or like even closer to when I was going to go to bed because that way it'll be more fresh. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I'm going to put my 
hair in like a low ponytail when I go to dance. So like, I'll put my hair straight tonight and then I'll put it in a ponytail when I go to bed. But like nothing too tight so that it doesn't leave a mark. Because a lot of times, like, you can probably tell my hair right there. That mark right there is a ponytail mark. So when I go to dance tomorrow, I'll make sure that I wear my hair in a low pony or in like a really loose braid so that, that way it won't curl and it'll just stay straight because otherwise it gets super annoying and hard to deal with. And then on Sunday, I have a show, which is insane. This is like, the fact that everything is creeping up like this quickly is kind of scary. Like putting this in the perspective that we're already over a week into Vlogmas really puts it in perspective for me that like Christmas is not that far away. Which I'm not super stressed out about because I do have all my gifts for friends and family. So I don't have to worry about any of that. But like 2024 is coming up way too quick. It does not feel like it should be here already. Oh. So I folded all of these clothes and now I'm just going to put them where they need to be. And then we're going to go start dinner. Okay guys, I just got done with dinner and it was so good. So now it is time to take a bath. After I take my bath, I'm probably going to straighten my hair then, then make sure all of my stuff is ready for the barn in the morning so that I don't have to get up as early. That way I can get up at like 6.30 and all of my clothes will already be like set out for me so I'll be good. I still cannot believe the orientation is tomorrow. This is like unreal. Okay guys, it is currently 7.50 and I'm now going to head and straightening my hair it feels so weird to straighten it at night like not that like i've never not gotten ready at night before but like something about doing it like before i go to bed i'm in my pajamas feels weird not weird but just like not weird it feels weird. also don't mind the way that i straighten my hair it's the only way that i know how to do it by myself and i know it's silly but it works so I actually ended up not taking a bath because I forgot that I took a shower this morning. I don't know how I forgot, but I forgot. So I do not need to take a bath. I will be fine. And then when I'm done with this, like I've said, I'll pick up my clothes for dance in the barn to make things easier when I have to get up tomorrow. And then, I don't know. I have to edit this video, obviously, but I might journal and read for a little bit. I haven't journaled in a really long time, so I think that that would be good to, like, start doing now. Especially now that we're a solid week into Vlogmas. Okay, my hair is all done, and it looks super nice and straight. But now we're going to grab a little Wegmans bag and put all my clothes in there that I need for, like, getting ready. So, like, my makeup and my perfume and that outfit that's sitting right there are going to go in that bag. Okay, so now it's time to go ahead and pack all my makeup, so I'll be showing you guys what I'm going to pack. First, starting off with my e.l.f. concealer, then my Ulta Beauty Bouncy Blush. I really need a new blush, but I've stated this multiple times. Then my Winter Ice Highlighter by Ben Nye. Looks like that. And then my Heavy Daily Eyelash Curler, even though I really need a new one. My Princess Lash by Essence Mascara. And then I have to decide what lip gloss I'm going to wear. We're going to go with this one, Bright Christmas Morning, that I got from Bath & Body Works. And then I'm also going to put in here my Sol de Janeiro. I forgot which one is. Potassio and Salted Caramel, 62. That will go in there. I think that's all that I need for makeup. Well, some brushes would be nice blush brush and my foundation blender beauty blender i think that's all i need for 
makeup. So that's all I need to put in this bag, but I still have to get like my clothes, my jewelry, and my brush and stuff. So I decided that I think that I might pack the straightener just in case my hair does get like unstraightened. So that way I can just quickly run it through when I'm at the studio. This bag might not be big enough. I was gonna use a Wegmans bag, but I was like, you know what, this one will probably be easier. But now I generally don't know if it's gonna be able to like fit everything. I'm going to throw, mm, that's not so hot. I love how I just stuck my finger on it to make sure it wasn't hot. But anyway, we're gonna put the straightener in there and then I'm going to grab my brush from the bathroom and also put that in there. And then I think that I will be good. Yeah, so we'll zip this bag up pretty much and this is ready for tomorrow. I just gotta get my barn clothes and my dance clothes ready for the morning. Now, before I do my skincare, I'm going to go ahead and make my bed because it's looking chaotic. I don't even know where my sheets went. So we're going to do that and then I'll move on to skincare. Also, I knew I said I was going to pack my jewelry, but I, the only thing that I want to wear is this Kendra Scott necklace. So I'm just going to put it on now so I already have it for the morning. Finally got it looking cute and back to normal, which is good. Also, for tomorrow's Vlogmas video, I just posted a thing on my Instagram story where you guys can go ask me some questions because tomorrow will be a answering your guys' questions video. So if you want your question to be in my video, go ahead and go to my Instagram, which is helena.mason, and go check out my Instagram story and you can see where you guys can ask me some questions. Hey guys! Vlogmas Day 8, I'm here with question of the day. Um, I'm on FaceTime with Helena. Um, what are you getting your friends for Christmas this year? Okay, guys. I was just sitting here editing this video when I realized that I did not show you what I was wearing to the barn. And I didn't do my skincare with you guys yet. So we're going to do both of those things right now. So this is barn slash dance. So this is for dance. But I have these plain black leggings from... 90 degree i love these leggings they're so soft these are like generally one of my favorite pairs of leggings for dance and skating because when i wear them to skating they come down fully to my ankles which is great my Billie eilish concert t-shirt i miss this concert so much i can't believe that it's coming up on two years since i went that's crazy that's crazy time is going by too fast <laughs> i've talked about this so much in this video but like recently stuff has been hitting me like way too fast and it's like scaring me but let's focus on the moment i have this new york yankees sweatshirt i'm also going to put my big like barn coat over top of it even though i'm not really sure what the temperature is like tomorrow and then for pants for the barn i just have my plain old barn jeans that's why they are dirty but that is it and now we're going to go ahead and do some skincare you guys might be wondering why I'm not wearing, like, I didn't show my leotard in that. That is because on Saturdays, I don't normally have to wear a leotard. Because I only have to teach in the morning. I have musical theater, which we don't need a leotard for. And then I have Peter and the Wolf rehearsal. And I don't really need a leotard for that either. And I'm only going to be there for half the rehearsal because halfway through, I have to stop get ready for orientation and then go to orientation. Now that it's time for skincare, I'm going to talk about the process of my skincare again because tonight is not a full skincare night. It's one of like my quarter half nights. So on full skincare nights, I do micellar water, cleanser, toner, moisturizer, serum, and face scrub, and my lip balm. Those are full, but I don't like to do those every night because then it gets too much skincare. And you would think like, Oh, look, there's no such thing as too much skincare, but at the same time, skincare products are still products and they're not always good for your face every single night to be putting them on all together as one big group. So I separate my mind into three separate nights. So that's the first night. The second night, then I use my cellar water and my CeraVe facial cleanser and my lip balm, and it's just those two. That's my second night. And then my third night, which is tonight, I use plain soap to wash my face, so like dove soap like this, 
and then my Bioma moisturizer because sometimes plain soap can dry out your face. So I always like to moisturize after using plain soap and then my lip balm and then I call it a night. Also, I don't have a ton of makeup on right now. So like there's no reason for me to do like full skincare. The only time that I'll do like a double full skincare will be like this weekend. So obviously tomorrow is Saturday. So then after day three, I go all the way back and I go to day one. And because tomorrow is Saturday and then Sunday I have a show. So when I get home from that show, I'm going to have a lot of makeup on my face. So then I'm going to want to do my full skincare again. So this Saturday and Sunday, I will be doing my full skincare both nights in a row. But then on Monday, I will go right back to day two of skincare. I don't know if that's a lot. I feel like that's a lot, but I feel like I really needed to like explain that in depth because I've never fully done that before. I'm going to brush my teeth first and then I will go ahead and do my skincare. Okay, you guys, with all that said, that is going to be the end of today's Vlogmas. I hope you guys enjoyed this productive night in my life, and I hope to see you guys in the next Vlogmas. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel for more Vlogmas content. I love you guys so much. Bye!